This is Steve Rybrook with LedgeView Partners, and today I want to demonstrate the territory management feature of our CRM for oil and gas product. This is one of many features that our oil and gas CRM product has, but uh, today's video is all about territory management. I just want to point out before we jump into the presentation that the CRM you're about to see is powered by Microsoft Dynamics CRM. But we also do projects with uh, Salesforce.com. So with that being said, let's flip right over to our CRM and take a quick peek. So our territory management happens to just be a dashboard in our workplace area of CRM. And the whole concept here is to be able to plot on a map uh, a list of accounts and leads based on some criteria. So there's three different ways to do it. Um, the first way I kind of got set up ahead of time just to save us a little bit of time. But the first option is really to map accounts and leads within the radius of an address. So if I'm going to be in Green Bay, Wisconsin, I could put in a more uh, specific address if I wanted to. But if I just knew I was going to be in that city, I could put all this in, say show me on a map, and it's going to analyze all my accounts and leads that are in CRM, and it's going to plot them on a map for me. And it will also list them out down here below. And if I wanted this for some other analysis, I could export this to Excel if I wanted to. You'll notice that there are different pin colors. I can show controls here. And it brings me back to the screen I was at originally. And it gives me a little legend over here as to what each color represents. The reason we have the show controls and height controls is just to give you a little bit more real estate on the screen. So that's why we added that. The other thing I want to point out that's, that's kind of nice is if you hover over any of these pins, it will show you the name of the account or the lead and a little bit of information about them and let you schedule an appointment. Or if I click on the name, it'll jump right back into the account screen in CRM. And here I can do you know, a lot more analysis. I could look at you know, the last time they ordered, what they've been buying, do I have any open opportunities, you know, who are the contacts for that company. So now you're just back to normal CRM, you know, the account screen, and all the things you can do within that. So I could close out of that, jump right back here. Um, the other thing I can do on here is if I'm going to be visiting a customer, and I actually looked up Fairview Manufacturing, um, if I'm going to be visiting a particular customer, I can say, well, show me all of my accounts or leads within 20 miles. And I could change that if I wanted to, to let's say 10 or 5, but I'll leave it 20. I could search and show on a map all those within, you know, near Fairview Manufacturing and say, show me those on a map. So now it, it found out where Fairview Manufacturing is, which must be one of these near the middle of Chicago. Okay, there's Fairview. And these are all my accounts and or leads within 20 miles of that. So why would I use this? Um, if I'm going to go visit them, maybe I'm starting out over here and I've got to drive into Chicago. Well, if I'm going to do that, why not um, maybe take a look at some of these other accounts, pull up their account, figure out if it's time for a visit, and maybe schedule, schedule a trip at the same time just to you know, help plan my day, make me be more efficient. The third option is a little bit more um, intense, in-depth, if you will. And that lets you map accounts or leads you know, on a map based on a view. So a view is just a different way of looking at your data. So there are a lot of system views, plus you can create your own views. So as an example, this may be a poor example, but I made a view out there of all my accounts that haven't over 12 months. Now, you can use your imagination, right? You could come up with any criteria you want over your views, over your data, and then you could plot that on a map. So here's looking at all my accounts you know, that haven't ordered in 12 months. So it's test data, so it's probably not the greatest. Um, but also, if I zoomed in here a little bit, you know, maybe it's not as bad as it originally looked. You know, In Wisconsin, I've got a couple. I see there's some, some in this general area over here in Michigan, so maybe I I plan a trip and I go visit them, or I or I jump over here. I realize that uh, you know we lost uh, an account manager over in Ohio, and so these accounts stop getting some attention, and so maybe that explains why they stop buying. So uh, one one way that I've seen this used is I, I've had one client who made a view, made multiple views of all their accounts that are in certain 
uh, routes that when they deliver each day or each week. And then if the person um, scheduling the truck doesn't have a full load, he can pop that view up on here and maybe, you know, obviously it won't look like this, but if he sees who's all on that route visually and he knows where he's headed today, um, he can take a look at some of the accounts on that route knowing that, okay, this particular account isn't getting a load today. He can jump into that account screen, find out when the last time they ordered, look at the contact information, and, and if it makes sense, maybe make a quick phone call to see if they would like to get delivered today. Um, to make their delivery scheduling uh, just that much more efficient and productive, you know, going with a full truck rather than a half a truck is just going to save save them a lot of time and money. So that's pretty much it. That's territory management, a uh, very popular feature with our product. I'm going to just jump back to the PowerPoint here to wrap a couple things up. Just a couple more things about uh, LedgeView Partners. Just wanted to let you know that CRM is all we do from our leadership all the way down to our support team, our developers, our, our project managers, myself included, you know, that's all we really do is CRM. That's, that's our company. That's what we do. We do have expertise in the oil and gas industry, so that helps with this oil and gas product. When we're working with you, we can talk your language. And then again, I mentioned we do Dynamics and we do Salesforce.com. And then finally, if you like what you see or have questions, want to learn more, um, Kevin Brown is the person you would contact to take a deep dive. He'll demonstrate the oil and gas product. He'll talk to you about other options that you have, you know, with our organization as far as CRM goes. So there's his phone number and his email address. So with that, I want to thank you so much for listening and have a great day.